What's up guys, I the way Soap here and today I wanted to compare the old version of Siri versus the latest version of Siri. I wanted to look at the speed, the UI changes, the answers, what's changed throughout the years. Anyway, let's get to some of the questions and take a look at the difference in the UI and see how Siri has changed throughout the years. Hello Siri. Hi. Hey. What's the weather in Tokyo? Here's the weather okay. for Tokyo. Here's the Japan weather for today. Tokyo. Japan for today. Now there's a few things you'll notice right away. Siri on iOS 6 has a very unique style presentation for the weather, including the button to activate Siri is completely different from anything else you see out there. Of course, this iPad is running iOS 6, so the look may look a little dated, but I actually like it. Over here on the right, this looks a little standard. It doesn't differentiate itself from anything out there, in my opinion. The presentation on iOS 10 Siri in comparison to iOS 6. What are the NBA stats? Checking on that. Here's what's schedule. coming up in the Here's NBA, the NBA for today. schedule for today. Okay, so same answers here, uh, but again, a different presentation, a nice card here, very unique. Over here, just kind of standard stuff, iOS 10 flat look uh, for Siri here on the NBA stats schedule. What's the distance between Earth and the moon? Hmm, Let checking my sources. The distance from the Earth to the moon is the about distance from the Earth to the moon. Else. Okay, so a pretty similar answer. Now let's get into some funny questions. How do I hide a dead body? What again? What again? How do I hide a dead body? I used to know the answer to this. <laughs> Siri iOS 6 says, I used to know the answer to this. Now, if you follow Siri uh, from back in the day, this was an Easter egg that Siri will tell you how to hide a dead body. It was sort of a joke. It's kind of funny to see that iOS 6 will kind of remember that, uh, but iOS 10, of course, uh, seems oblivious to what the answer to that would have been. Do you like Android? I'm all I'm Apple. pretty loyal to time. Apple. It's just how I'm made. Oh, of course. Who created you? I, I Siri, Siri, was designed, was designed by, by Apple, Apple in California. California. Who is Steve Jobs? Thanks for asking, Thanks for about, asking Steve. about Steve. Here's Apple's, web page, Apple's about him. web page about him. Okay, so we tap here. It'll take us to Safari, yes. And over here, it'll bring us to Safari as well. Different animations, of course, different software. A uh, nice presentation. What's the battery percentage? Your iPad Just see your battery level. Look for the battery icon in the upper right corner of okay. your screen. To turn on battery percentage, you can do this in settings, general, usage, battery percentage. Well, wow, Siri was very detailed in explaining how to turn on battery percentage, work, I can find it. Uh, the iPad here on iOS 10, the iPad Pro just gave me the percentage. Uh, both got the job done, but more specific on iOS 6. Open settings. Here we go. Turn on Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is you already on. to the latest version of iOS, I'll be able to help you with that. Okay, so Siri here on iOS 6 is telling me that if I update to the latest version of iOS, which I'm not going to do, uh, she would be able to help me with things like Wi-Fi and toggles and all that good stuff. But there you guys have it. This was just a quick video taking a look at Siri, uh, the UI, the speed, the changes. What are your thoughts? Uh, do you use Siri anymore? Uh, the only things I use Siri for is timers, reminders, nothing much. As I mentioned, Apple is set to be expanding on Siri this year with iOS 11 and also integrating it to additional hardware to compete with Google Home and Alexa from the Amazon Echo. And that about brings it into this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Taking a look back at Siri iOS 6 versus Siri iOS 10. It's been iDevice Help and I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.